In this video, I'm going to show you how to make cute animations very simply. I'm using an iPad, which is actually probably one of the easiest way to animate characters. You see here um, some possible ways to do animation, um, but probably the simplest of all is Puppet Pals HD. You can explore Puppet Pals 2 and Toontastic, which have more elaborate moving characters, but also require more investment of time. Puppet Pals HD can get you up and running in um, a video in a matter of two or three minutes. First of all, let me show you the show that I've already recorded. Um, the Founding Fathers. If freedom of speech is taken away, then dumb and silent we may be led, like sheep to the slaughter. The legitimate powers of government extend to such acts only as are injurious to others. It does me no injury for my neighbor to say that there are 20 gods or no god. It neither picks my pocket nor breaks my leg. The Constitution only guarantees the American people the right to pursue happiness. You have to catch it yourself. Okay, so as you can see, uh, the video is simple but cute and gets its point across. So how do you go about making a video like this? Back at the start, we simply say, press to start, we choose our characters. In this case, I've chosen Martin Luther King Jr. and Rosa Parks. I choose my setting. I'm going to choose the city street. And then there are my characters. I can push record and then move my characters around any way I want, have them interact. I could have as many characters as I want. And then when I'm done, I push stop. I save it and I'm going to call this video three. And so now I've saved it. There we go. And it's in my saved shows. Of course, it's still on the iPad and you may want to get it out of your iPad to post on YouTube or um, uh, be able to show it on your computer or upload it to Sophia. So in that case, I have to use export. The video is being exported to my photos, my camera roll, otherwise known. And so now I uh, push the home button to go all the way out and go to my photos. There are my photos. And here I have, I can choose the video that I want to email to myself. And I simply, I choose it by checking on it there. And then I can push the mail button. In which case I will be able to email it to my desktop computer. It's compressing the video now uh, to email because video files are quite large. And then now I just simply send it to my, um, via my school email and then I can pick it up on my school computer and play it on my school computer. There we go. Uh, thanks for watching.